everybody, Joe here for JVC. A camcorder like the Wi-Fi enabled Avario has dozens of features that let you wirelessly share your pictures and videos with friends, family, or the entire world. With all that functionality comes a number of email addresses, passwords, and other settings that must be entered to make it all work, which is a lot to type using a touchscreen. Well, JVC has come up with a way to let you enter those settings from the comfort of your Mac or PC keyboard using a web browser. Once the settings are entered, a custom QR code is generated, which the Avario reads and then enters the data for you automatically. You can create QR codes for a number of different items, like the settings on your access point, indoor and outdoor monitoring configurations, or entering email accounts and addresses, which we'll look at now. QR codes are created using the web user guide, which can be found online at this address. Once you've selected your model, click here to continue. Then select the link labeled Using Wi-Fi by creating a QR code, and you'll see a list of the items you can create QR codes for. For this example, we'll create a series of QR codes to set up the detect mail function. As you can see, there are spaces for entering up to eight email addresses to be recipients of your images or videos. So let's add a few now. For each recipient, you can decide if they will receive still images from the detect mail function, video emails, or both. When you've entered all the desired information, click the Creating QR Code button and a QR code will be displayed on the screen. So now it's time to start the QR code reading function on the Avario. To begin, tap Menu, and then the Wi-Fi icon. Scroll to the right and select Common Wi-Fi Setting. Then select Set from QR Code, and then tap Execute. The Avario is now ready to scan the first QR code, so go ahead and point it at the browser screen so that the codes line up in the box shown on the touch screen. Once the code has been read, tap Yes to accept the code, then Next to read the code for the next email address. You can repeat this process for each of the remaining email addresses. Once you've entered the last email address, tap Next rather than OK to get the Avario ready to read the sender's email address. Keep in mind that a SMTP email account is required. Those that can only be accessed via a web interface, like Yahoo, are not supported. To set up the sender's email address, move on to the next section of the web user guide and enter the address you'd like recipients to see as the return address on email sent from the Avario. Then click Creating QR Code. A QR code will be displayed, so point the Avario at the code to read it in. You'll repeat this same process for each of the remaining settings, such as detection method, detection interval, and so on, until all the relevant data has been entered. As you may have noticed, the Avario understands what each code is for and stores it under the appropriate setting automatically, so you're free to create and enter any QR code at any time, and the Avario will ensure the settings always get to the right place. When you're done reading the final code, tap OK to return to the main menu. Now that you've entered all the settings, let's take a look at how we can use the detect mail function. When activated, a still image is automatically captured and sent via email whenever faces or movements are detected by the camera. The direct mail and video mail features require the Avario to be registered with a Wi-Fi access point since they make use of the indoor or outdoor monitoring modes. To find out how to register your Avario with an access point, See the Setting Up an Access Point video for more information. Be sure to position the camera and adjust the zoom, focus, and other settings first because once the Detect Mail function is activated, those adjustments are disabled. When you're ready, tap the Menu button, then Wi-Fi, and then Detect Mail. Tap the Detect Mail Attention button to select up to eight email addresses to be recipients. Once they've been selected, Tap Start, and the Avario will connect to your access point and go into detection mode. When movement or a face is detected, the Avario snaps a picture, sends it to the recipients, and then waits for the preset length of time before going back into detection mode. While the Avario is in detection mode, you can still access the live monitoring capabilities of the Avario Sync 2 app or web browser. The Avario simply suspends detection mode until you exit the app 
or log out of the Live Monitor browser window. Be aware that the Detect Mail feature can generate a large number of emails depending on your environment and Averio settings. And even though the images it sends are small, you should still plan accordingly. I'm Joe for JVC, and this has been another one of the ways Averio is part of your totally connected lifestyle.